Well, what's up, fam? Guess what? Today, I'm going to take a ride to the shop. Start getting my shopping order. Oh, but first, thank you to my lovely wife for washing my car. Since she was doing hers, and mine too. I think jewels look beautiful. Mm -hmm. Sure enough. All right. That door's locked, of course. Let's get on this journey. Oh, yeah. Now, I have been in the wife's Jeep, and I've been driving her Jeep on these little trips. But today, we're in my car, and I'm pretty sure since I started vlogging, we haven't rode in my car, or have we? I can't really remember, honestly. Uh, if we had, leave a comment. If we hadn't, leave a comment. And uh, the best way to tell is if I open the door at night and you see a red light, that's my car. And if you see a blue light, that'd be the wife's car. So... Go. Rumble on that motor right there. This will be the second time I drove it since I've done the intake manifold. And this will be the longest that I've driven it since I've done the intake manifold because the last time I drove it was just to my band room and back. All right now we're letting it idle up and we're getting ready to roll. First, let's find you guys a good spot to sit. I think y'all ride shotgun. All right, well, we're gonna see how this rolls. I've seen how far we've gone. That is breaking me. I fell down to the stone. That is taking me. little bit and I am back so I got my tank of gas uh well I got 12 gallons and some on uh 12 and some on gallons of gas and topped it off with some 93 I'm not changing my tune yet because I want to get some more 93 through it before I do that I'd like to have a full tank of 93 not partial and the reason being is I don't want to uh, run it too uh, lean, not having the right octane gas in there. The higher the octane, the cooler the cylinders after the burn. Traffic, oh, I have not been in traffic in a minute. And it's been a while since I've been to my shop before the surgery, so a little over two months. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. 
maybe not real fast, but she gets me to point A to point B pretty quick. Quick enough. She's running good. right now thermostats open fans running and my temps are dropping cool put a 180 temp uh, thermostat in there so 180 degrees Fahrenheit it opens up and allows the water to flow through the motor out of the radiator um, and then I set my fan low speed to 180 also when it opens up but honestly I think I'm going to change that to um, to come on low at 190 and high at 200 because I don't really need the fan to be running when the thermostat opens, I don't suppose. Because usually I'll be driving, and most time you're driving anyways, pulling air through the radiator. Fire in my gut, my rage won't endure Cannot contain this dream, I'm done with this hell
shop in over two months and this is my area and I don't expect it to be clean because it's my responsibility to clean it but here is the area I got to work on <laughs> yeah of my shit yep that's the funny man right there so they're supposed to be cleaning the shop here the last two months while I was gone, and we're going to find out if they have. And this is my 20 year plus employee. This is his area. Has it been cleaned? Actually it has. It actually has. So that's a good thing. That looks good. It's better than what it was. I'm not going to complain about that. We got all that down that way. That's a lot of shit there. This is also my stuff that I got to worry about. Ugh. And, uh, and this is the van I gotta get back together but yeah I told them not to worry about cleaning this stuff up that is not my stereo system um, but yeah all this stuff right here another machine on my trailer there and is still in the works it is not completed I got unfinished projects. I gotta get blue back together, wheel on. This may become the band van. I gotta get a machine in this one, and that will give me four vans with machines in them. Make sure this is running properly. This is the area that I'm really concerned about. Right there. You know that? The only light has been strained up too much. has been slightly arranged and um but really not much been done over here i kind of expected that that's why i told them put all the extra metal crap was in there but hoses here um spare tire constantly was washing machine 
Alright, other than that, we're looking pretty good. That's the walk through, and now I know exactly what I got looking at, and I can figure out what my progress is from there. So, later. Did a little bit of work on my on my area there, kind of get some stuff straightened out, get straightened up, get myself ready for my little projects I have to do for the company and the personal ones I want to do for myself. So here we go, head to the house because the back now is starting to hurt a little bit, and uh, I am ready to go home and sit down for a bit yeah so I didn't overdo it I try not to lift anything heavier than my 40 pounds so I stay stay true to what my restrictions are um, and I did get my welding bench cleaned and my tool with bench a little bit cleaner um, really not organizing anything on the bench just kind of condensing things to buckets and bins of random stuff because that's kind of what's in there now i did look for my sunglasses which i didn't find so i'm not sure where those are at kind of sucks that's okay i just have to get some new ones yep that's all i have to do just get some new ones so this is my way back so this time we're gonna go back a little bit longer way it's a two-lane highway instead of a four-lane highway and it's uh oh god you know i used to go over these things right here they used to kill me that's no spinal pain there at all god that's awesome i can't believe that i've never it's been a long time um, since I've been in this two months since I've been through here and I feel pretty good yeah really good so yeah I changed the uh, temp on my fan to come on at 190 on low 200 on high and it's a 180 thermostat Right now we're looking at 190, 188, 
a van on because it is warm out in here. But I don't need a AC, just my van. faster we might have made it mm -hmm. oh you can go that way huh sure girl go that way you don't sit there for a minute of course that may not be from around here my mom would say They may not know where they're going. 